COVID-19 vaccine is rolling out to residents and staff in 1,400 long-term care nursing facilities in Virginia. Walgreens and CVS have partnered with the federal government to go into these centers and administer the shots on site. I went to Lake Taylor Transitional Care Hospital in Norfolk this morning, where some of the staff lined up early to get immunized. The line is long, but they don't mind waiting. I was so excited this morning. I woke up at five. Respiratory therapist Cookie Perry even dressed for the occasion. We're chasing away the villain COVID-19. I've got my villain sweatshirt on. CVS pharmacist will administer 400 shots here over two days. I'm just excited to to be able to restore some hope. Hope for staff like Edward Robinson, who not only works with COVID patients, he does so at great risk to himself. I'm a two-time cancer survivor. Okay, uh, uh, I have only 80% of my lung capacity, and I take care of COVID-19 patients. And hope for residents who have basically lived in seclusion since March. You know, we went through Mother's Day, Father's Day, Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's, and uh, we've only had window visits. Hospital President Tom Orsini was first to roll up his sleeve, leading by example. Not all have agreed to get the shot. The day of. People really going to get excited about it and want to do it. So I think we're going to get a lot of late, last minute, you know, sign ups. But adding doses day of can be tricky. This stuff is like liquid gold. No one wants to waste a drop. It's a little stressful. There's lots of emotions that happen. A lot of planning goes into every shot. Pharmacists have six hours to use the thawed Pfizer vaccine, so they only prepare what they expect they'll need. If there's extra, the good thing is then that's when we get to get ours if we haven't already. No wasted doses and no wasted hope for all those who still wait. CVS will be back out at the Lake Taylor facility in 21 days to administer the second doses of vaccine.